The San Diego Zoo is about to release Endangered Stevens kangaroo rats, um, our last group of 30 of 150. Stevens kangaroo rats are endangered and there are more of them, we think, on um, areas slated for development or that are being impacted by humans than there are on the reserve. So we need to learn how to move them from areas where they're being impacted into protected land. This year we're looking at how mowing, grazing, and burning to open the habitat um, can be used for the initial stages of, re of restoration and how, um, how the kangaroo rats respond to those treatments during translocation. So we're looking to see what their habitat preferences are during settlement. We put out acclimation cages for the animals which um, allows them to have a soft release so they're habituated for about a week to the area, and then we, we pull those um, cages off, but they get to keep their artificial burrows. Um, and then we supplement them for a couple of months with seed. And we're gonna do some observations with night vision goggles um, to see how they um, interact with their habitat, whether they immediately reject the site and how they're interacting with residents if they're present. And we track them to see where they, where they settle. We're locating where they've slept. Okay. So they sleep during the day, and we're locating where they chose to sleep. Some of the animals actually stay in the acclimation uh, cages for a long period of time. Other ones move uh, right outside and can dig burrows right near the acclimation cages. Um, but some animals choose to completely reject the site, and they will go out off of the site and look for a new place to live. When you first release them, you're sort of crossing your fingers and hoping for the best and then you see them digging their own burrows and the babies come up in a few months so they're actually really you know settling in and and producing producing young so you can you can see that they're making a difference out here <laughs>